All right, increased security is expected at private high, at a private high school this morning after a shooting threat shut it down on Friday. Yeah, CBS 2's Carl Finstrom is live outside Harvard Westlake School in Studio City, which is, by the way, reopening today. And Carl, what can you tell us? Yeah, well, the school was shut down because of a troubling post that was made by ex-NFL player Jonathan Martin. He went to school here. Well, this morning, TMZ is reporting some troubling new details as well about that police investigation that sources tell them Martin had a gun with him when officers detained him and is undergoing a psychiatric evaluation. I'll show you the Instagram story we're talking about. It included a shotgun and was posted with the hashtags Miami Dolphins and Harvard Westlake and the words, when you're a bully victim and a coward, your options are suicide or revenge. DMZ Sports now reports numerous sources told them Detective Sink Martin recently purchased two weapons and one matched the gun in the post. Those sources told TMZ there was a gun in Martin's car when he was detained. In 2013, Martin accused his then Dolphins teammate, Richie Incognito, of bullying. Incognito was suspended. On Thursday, he and two of Martin's former school classmates were tagged in the post. Campuses across the Southland have been dealing with increased threats of school shootings. Over the weekend, families at Norwalk High School worried about social media threats of a school shooting there. However, the Sheriff's Department says they tracked that post to the person involved and have dismissed it as an attempt to get out of school. Now, back here live, uh, schools across the Southland, Jeff and Sharon, have been dealing with numerous threats of school shootings since uh, the massacre in Florida happened almost two weeks ago now. And law enforcement really continuing to try and get out the word that every single one of those threats will be taken very seriously with big consequences for students.